Good day. As we come to terms with our new reality, I would like to share some important information with you that will help keep you, your family and our communities safe. My name is Professor Graham Mankis from the University of Cape Town Department of Medicine and I work as an infectious diseases specialist at Khuriskia Hospital in Cape Town. Coronaviruses are a family of viruses that commonly cause mild respiratory illness throughout the year, otherwise referred to as the common cold. Almost everyone has been infected with a coronavirus, often without knowing it. In December 2019, a new type of coronavirus called SARS-CoV-2 was first recognised in sick persons linked to a wildlife market and rapidly spread across the globe, affecting people in almost every country now, including South Africa. This new coronavirus is the cause of an infection called COVID-19. The vast majority of people who develop COVID-19 infection have mild symptoms, which usually include dry cough, fever, and muscle aches, and recover completely after about a week. We think even a larger group of people who get infected never develop any symptoms, but may still be able to infect others. So although our individual risk of getting seriously ill is very low with coronavirus, certain people who get COVID-19 may have a severe or even life-threatening illness. If we do not take urgent actions, many people will get infected and a large number of people will need care in our hospitals, which may quickly overwhelm our health services. It is our collective responsibility to protect each other by slowing the spread of coronavirus in our communities and conserving masks and gloves for healthcare workers to use when they look after sick people. This really is a collective responsibility that falls on every South African. The main way in which COVID-19 spreads is when people who are infected cough or sneeze, producing droplets containing the virus. The virus can survive on surfaces for over a day. And when somebody else comes along and touches those surfaces with their hand, and then touch your eyes, nose or mouth, you may then become infected. You may also be infected directly by someone with COVID-19 if you are very close to them, one and a half meters or closer when they sneeze or cough, and then they breathe in the uh, particles that are produced containing the virus and become directly infected. The best ways to do this are, firstly, regularly washing your hands with soap and water or an alcohol-based hand rub for 20 seconds, which will kill any virus on your hands. Wearing gloves does not provide additional protection and may even put you at higher risk because the virus remains on plastic for many hours. Secondly, stop touching your face. And very importantly, distance yourself from other people respecting the lockdown that our president announced. The most effective thing you can do to protect yourself and others is to stay at home. Only go out to buy essential items like food and medicine. Connect with other people using social media. Cancel face-to-face -face meetings and stop all physical contact with other people except your close family that you're living with. If you do get sick, and you are worried you have COVID-19, then call the Department of Health hotline on 0800 029 999 to find out if you need testing. Do not leave your house unless you need medical attention. Make contact with the hotline or your doctor if you become short of breath or if you are worried about any of your other symptoms for advice about how to get help. COVID-19 is in South Africa and will spread quickly through our country if we don't take urgent action now. We will only be able to beat it and return to our normal lives if we all play our part. It only takes two people to start a new wave of transmission. We are all in this together. Please stay at home and stay safe.